Hi everyone, welcome to my class. In this class, we want to find the value of a from this given equation, a raised to power 3 plus a square is equal to 36. But before we proceed, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Thank you. Solution. We have the given equation a raised to power 3 plus a square is equal to 36. Then we have a raised to power 3 plus a square minus 36 is equal to 0. Now we want to find the roots, one of the roots. Then let's try at a equal to 1. If a is equal to 1, we have 1 raised to power 3 plus 1 square minus 36 is not equal to 0. Let's test at a equal to 2. Then this will be 2 raised to power 3, that is 8 plus 2 square 4 minus 36 is not equal to 0. But at a equal to 3, then we have 3 raised to power 3 plus 3 square minus 36, this one is equal to 0, because 3 raised to power 3 is 27, then plus 3 square is what? 9 minus 36, then we have 27 plus 9, that is 36 minus 36, this is equal to 0. Therefore, one of the root is A equal to what? 3. Therefore, we have A minus 3 is one of the factors. Then let's look for other factors. From this, we have A minus 3. Then what is here? We need to know what we multiply A minus 3 with. Then equal to 0. Now, we can get that using long division, which is the easiest way. We have the given equation. A raised to power 3 plus a square minus 36 is equal to 0. Then by using long division, we want to divide with this a minus 3. Then we have a minus 3. Then a raised to power 3 plus a square minus 36. So we want to get other roots. Then a divided by a raised to power 3, we have a square. Now, a square times a, that is a raised to power 3. Then, a square times minus 3, that is minus 3a square. Now, let's multiply by minus. This one will cancel the x. We have 3a square plus a square. That will be 4a square. Then here will be what? 4a square minus this 36 will come down. We have 36. Now again, we have a divided by 4a square. We have plus 4a. Then 4a times a. That is 4a square. Then 4a times minus 3. That is minus 12a. Multiply this one, we'll cancel this. Then here we have, this is plus 12a minus 36. Let's bring it down. We have 12a minus 36. Now let's divide again. A goes in 12a. We have plus 12. This is a long division method. Then 12 times a. That is 12a. Then 12 times minus 3. That is minus 36. Now multiply by negative. This one will cancel. This one will cancel. Here we what? 0 and 0. We have this equation a square plus 4a plus 12. Then which is going to be multiplied by this factor or root. We have a square plus 4a plus 12. So here is now a square plus 4a plus 
12 we have a minus 3 multiplied by a square plus 4a plus 12 equal to 0 a minus 3 equal to 0 therefore a is equal to what 3 this is one of the roots then let's find the other root from this given equation and this is a quadratic equation we have a square plus 4a plus 12 is equal to what zero now we can solve this using quadratic general formula s is equal to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac divided by 2a and the given equation is a square plus 4a plus 12 equal to 0 from here a is equal to 1 b is equal to what 4 and c is equal to what 12 then let's substitute back into this equation we have a is equal to we have minus b is what 4 that is minus 4 plus or minus square root of b is what 4 square minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by 12 then divided by 2 multiplied by 1 and then we have a is equal to minus 4 plus or minus square root of 4 square that is 16 minus 4 times 1 times 12 that is 48 divided by 2 2 times 1 that is 2 then we have a is equal to minus 4 plus or minus square root of 16 minus 48 minus 32 divided by 2 then we have a is equal to minus 4 plus or minus minus 32 can be write as 16 times minus 2 divided by 2 then we have a is equal to minus 4 plus or minus square root of 16 that is 4 root minus 2 divided by 2 but remember if you have square root of minus 1 is equal to what high then this equation become a is equal to minus 4 plus or minus 4 square root of 2 multiplied by minus 1 divided by 2 then we have a is equal to minus 4 plus or minus 4 square root of 2i divided by 2 then 2 here 1 2 here 2 here is 2 then we have a is equal to minus 2 plus 2 root 2i or minus 2 minus 2 root 2i then this is a complex solution and we do need complex solution then also we have our discriminant is equal to b square minus 4ac then our b is 4 discriminant is called what 4 square minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by 12 then here is what 16 minus 40 48 which is equal to minus 32 and minus 32 is less than zero 
then we conclude that no real real root. The only real root we have is a is equal to three. That is the only real root we have. So if you have enjoyed the class, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Thank you.